Welcome to Dog Stoke Studios. Today in the studio we're going to be painting a tiny epic dungeon model. We're going to pull one right out of here. Let's get to it. Okay, let's get a model. Tiny epic dungeon. Let's see. There it is. Right there. The dwarf. Of course, right? Look at him. Little badass. All right, let's get this guy primed up. As always, my go-to, Green Stuff World Mass Service Primer. Man, this stuff works wonders, I love it. It goes on so nice and neat and flat. Look at that mat. Anyway, Green Stuff World, Matt World, Service Primer. All right, let's do this again. Uh, dark Flesh, Vallejo Model Color, and Light Flesh, Vallejo Model Color. That's what I use. I'm going some of this, uh, this this purple shade here from Citadel uh, in on the armor now. I'm gonna shade it everything with purple and go from there, give it a base. All right, purple shade, purple shade base, real quick. Boom. I'm gonna try something a little different here for a red beard. Uh, I'm gonna go with some of this uh, Griffhound Orange uh, by Citadel Contrast Paint. I'll do that as a base on this bad boy. And then I'll move into the oranges. Base coat down for the hair. Nice little base orange, I like that. What is this? Griffhound Orange Contrast. Of course, I'm gonna go back and do some highlighting on this as well. Uh, maybe a little brighter orange, a little yellow, just to make a pop come out. All right, we're gonna get the boots with the uh, snake leather, snake bite leather. Contrast, color, sit down. All right, I went ahead and did the boots, snake bite leather. I also went ahead and did the belt back there as well. All right, onto the armor the gold trim. All right, for the armor and the gold trim, I'm gonna go with the, bruh, what is this, burnt umber. Uh, I'm gonna do brown over, and then I'm gonna come back and do some yellow, some yellow work, make it look gold, kind of a non-metallic, but anyway, check it out. Next highlight on the armor, on the gold. Possibly uh, Tiamat Orange, uh, Fantasy Games, and possibly Troll Slayer. Also, a little bit of yellow. All right, got that beard highlighted. All right, moving on to the hammer here. Uh, using uh, Secret Weapon Rubber. We can go right there. That's that's looking pretty good, pretty close to the arc there. Uh, not too bad. Not too bad. Let's go ahead and take this a little step further. We're gonna go ahead and paint the uh, hammer with uh, some little glow there, maybe even the eyes. Hey guys, I always finish up here with some matte varnish, uh, AKA interactive ultra matte varnish. Love this stuff. Anyway, gonna matte him up. 
Ford and Firebraid Dwarf Fighter. Here he is, Tiny Epic Dungeons. Dwarf. Well, painted up the dwarf in the Tiny Epic Dungeons. Uh, great little model, fun little paint job. Uh, please like and subscribe, as always. Uh, thank you. Uh, we'll see you on the next video. Bye. Welcome to Doc Six Studios. Right out of here. Uh, we're gonna pick it out and get something out of here. Jeez. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Thanks for joining us. Today, we're gonna be painting a tiny epic dungeon model. So, uh, here it is. Cut. Welcome to Doc Six Studios. Today, we're gonna be painting an epic, tiny epic dungeon model. Uh, okay.